Hey guys, just thought I would read you another book. This book is called, oh, sorry, what's it called? Starfish, Stars of the Sea by Connie and Peter Roop and illustrated by Carol Schwartz. Under the sea, along the shore, you guys know I love the sea and the seashore. Can't go there now, though. Look at those starfish. I love it. Live hundreds of starfish on the ocean floor. The ocean floor. That means all the way under the water at the bottom of the ocean where the sand is. But it's pretty deep, so you can't really, can't really get down there. But this is what's down there, guys. Starfish who live on the ocean bed are purple, orange, brown, and red. <clears throat> a starfish can be hard to see. Its colors hide it from an enemy. So I guess it's kind of camouflage. It tries to camouflage itself and blend in so that other fish won't come along and eat them. Eat them. Starfish bodies have no bones, so starfish can crawl into hidden homes. So he can squeeze in between those rocks, I guess, because he's flexible. He doesn't have any bones. He can smoosh himself in there. Even if enemies do attack, starfish are lucky. Look at that. A fish tried to get them. Their arms grow back. Oh my goodness. So if that fish ate one of the starfish arms, he can just grow another one. That's crazy. A starfish arm is called a ray. A spot on its tip tells night from day. So the tip of the starfish's arm can tell if it's day or night. So I guess it can detect light. That's interesting. I didn't know that. Oh, look at that beautiful one, guys. All you girls that have purple as your favorite color, look at that beauty. Oh, it's so pretty. Suckers help starfish walk and crawl and cling tightly to shells or a rocky wall. So those little things right there are like suction cups that squeeze and help them to latch on and stick on to things. Rays are like fingers. They touch and they feel. See those again? Those little things that are sticking out. There's some more seashells. I guess they have clams in them. Those shells used to have an animal in it, and then the animal leaves, and then the shell is still there. As starfish hunt for a shellfish meal. Oh, now see, the starfish eat the shellfish. And then the shell is just left there. A starfish holds a shellfish tight, then pulls it open with all its might. Starfish eat without any teeth. Their mouths are hidden underneath. Well, that is different, isn't it? Look at that little pokey thing. I can't remember what those are called. Could be anemones. I'm not sure what those are. Under the water. Starfish are sometimes called sea stars. That is their other name. They're so pretty. I love them so much. I've seen them before in real life, guys. But whether you call them starfish or sea stars, their lives are just the same. Really cool. Maybe if you want to, you can look up videos of real starfish and see them actually really swimming in the ocean in a video or something, guys. Okay, that was a cool book. Bye-bye.